hi traders welcome to the daily forex analysis by trade with us in chart let's begin our analysis with the uh, economic calendar though we have lots of news data uh, for today but most of these are of medium impact and uh, on the ecb uh, monetary policy meeting and then core cpi for us dollar is important other than that uh, i don't see much volatility in the market even uh, because uh, yesterday we uh, witnessed a very huge uh, volatility in the market so today can be just a continuity of the same trend but um, will be slower or sideways so overall uh, we expect a little stronger dollar and other instruments will go sideways or bearish we begin our analysis uh, with the us dollar currency index it's a daily time frame and here you can see us dollar has been just doing very well yesterday it gained a lot and today can be just a continuity but it can be slower my target for today is 94.98 and above on the other hand if it drops then it can go to 94.39 even one hour and four hour time frame also showing a good sign uh, right now it's just making a bullish flag and after a few hours or with us open it can again uh, continue its upward movement on the four hour time frame here it is you can see here and it will just uh, stay here for a while or can just come down until then we'll continue its upward movement uh, on the other hand it can just drop and lose all the gains it got yesterday in that case it can come to 94.39 we see euro usd and euro usd is not a very good picture uh, yesterday's bigger drop has caused and changed the momentum for your usd and it's right now it's heading to 1.1617 and in the longer run it's going to 1.15 uh, if anything uh, goes wrong with us dollar especially uh, our main concern was uh, us china relationships on the tariff uh, these things can turn down any time and us dollar can drop again in that case uh, euro usd will go up on the one hour and four hour time frame euro also not looking very good and here it's just making a bearish flag and it can continue downward on the four hour two it's uh, not very good though uh, at the moment it's just trying and if it can just uh, um, break this uh, 1.696 uh, level so you might see again an upward movement so for today uh, it can just uh, maximum go up to 1.17 to 1 we move to gbp usd and same story here too uh, yesterday uh, last week's gains were it raised in a few days and at the moment it's looking like it's uh, just a continuation of the downtrend like in the long run it can drop below 1.30 for today my target is 1.3092 and below on the other hand it can get uh, some strength and near reach up to 1.3291 on our time frame will show us the clear picture right now it's just struggling it's on a good support actually so if it drops below 1.3189 then it can drop further otherwise it's looking okay right now on the four hour two this current uh, candle will decide if it closes in green and a little higher then it can continue for a few next few hours in upward movement USD CAD uh, yesterday we had a very good trade actually uh, after the uh, interest rate but then that was erased by uh, oil prices the oil dropped very badly so this green candle is a result of that actually if I can show you the US uh, oil here it is the daily candle and uh, oil dropped uh, because of the 
uh, news that Libya is going to supply so there was a panic and you saw that so in the result of that USD CAD rose up again otherwise it was supposed to drop further anyway right now uh, it's uh, early morning so it can just drop a little bit and then continue upward my target for today is 1.3269 and above on the other hand it can drop again to 1.3130 on one hour and four hour it's looking like this this was the yesterday's uh, drop after the news but then it speedily recovered and went up that high so anything is possible in next few uh, days for Canadian dollar uh, you, if the oil gets back to the norm previous price then it's supposed to drop further on the 4 out 2 uh, right now it's just uh, retracing you know, doing some price correction and uh, I think US Open will decide uh, which way it wants to take USD cap our last pair gold and gold too looks very weak since this uh, day when the price got rejected I had some assumption that it will uh, drop to 12.36 and below but then it did well uh, the next day but uh, at the moment it's not very good side um, today my target is 12.36 uh, it's going to drop again hopefully if not then it's heading to 1251 let's check it on one hour and four hour uh, on the four, one hour it's just trying to hold this level and go up uh, it's not very clear maximum if it can come up I'm looking at 1249 and otherwise even our target uh, can be achieved but, uh, on the other hand it can also drop back again on the four hour we see a clear direction and here it is so at the moment yeah it's looking good so we will uh, see the momentum and the buyers uh, confidence again how they want to take gold so guys that's all for today uh, i wish you a profitable trading day take care of yourself and your trades i will see you with a new video until then take care and bye